recites Quran to me at home and she was reading this ayah and I was just checking her tajweed and she's reciting the ayah and I sat there and I started crying. She said, Abba, why are you crying? I said, because of what Allah said. You know, because of what Allah said. She said, what did He say? And I said, you know, He says, the messenger will complain about a group of people who left the Quran. And she says to me, but we didn't leave the Quran, we're reading it. And I said, Beta, if only it was just about reading, it would have been easy. It's not just about reading it. You have to love this. Can we, can we prove to ourselves we love this book more than any other movie that comes out? More than any video game? Do we, spend more t- do we want to spend more time with this book than anything else? Do we want to be like what this book wants us to be? More, like, more than we want to be like anyone else or anything else? How you younger guys want to look like ripped because they see a picture of a guy with muscles? Girls want to look like someone? People want to make money like someone. People idolize these people. Who idolizes the character that the Quran embodied? The Messenger of Allah sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Kana khuluquhu al Quran. Who like goes to sleep and I think, man, I wish I had a six pack. Instead of thinking, man, I wish I had more sunnah in my life. Who says that? Who? Well, how are we not abandoning it? How are we not abandoning it? We have to be a people that take coming back to Allah's book seriously. May Allah Azza wa Jal make us a people that love this book and make it a big part of our lives. So everything in our life is given blessing and given life through the barakah of this book. May Allah Azza wa Jal help the Muslims understand this book as they should understand it. May Allah help you as parents not only love and understand this book yourselves, but give you the ability to teach it to your children so your children can testify for you on Judgment Day. May Allah Azza wa Jal help the masajid, the schools, the, all these kids that are memorizing Quran. May Allah not just help them memorize Quran, on, but to help them understand every word of it and to live that word of it and to pray with their hearts not with their tongues when they pray may Allah make us of those people that really live the Quran and the Quran lives inside their hearts these are ayat that live in the chests of those who've been given knowledge chests the Quran lives in the person's heart may Allah enter this Quran into all of our hearts